Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be filming part two of the collective haul. Um, hopefully you have seen part one, which was up last week on my channel and the link will be in the description box below if you'd like to check that out. Part one is all the beauty items that I've picked up recently and this is part two, which is the clothing part of this collective haul. So this is a collective haul, which means I brought it over time and yeah, also disclaimer, um, I'm sorry if this offends you by me showing you what I've bought. I'm not trying to brag or shove it in your face or whatever. I'm just thought to share it with you. I don't know. Also, don't forget to check the description box below for a list of items. And if there is a link to the item, it'll also be there. As well as that, this haul is both in store and online of things I've bought. And the things in store are a mixture of op shops and retail stores. Mostly op shops. So that's all for the intro, hope you enjoy. Bye! So starting off with some online shopping, these items are from Runaway Bandits. They gave me this sample moisturiser. Then what I bought is this pair of overalls. They're full length, uh, not real denim, but denim look overalls and I think they're awesome. The problem is one of the straps broke on the first day I wore it, so quality is an A grade. But I think they look sick, I rolled them up at the bottom, they've got buttons everywhere, they're mad. Then the next thing I bought is this jumpsuit or play suit, whatever you call it, which has this sort of uh, David Jones pattern on it. If you don't know what that is, I guess it's sort of a geometric type of pattern with this lovely cutout on the stomach. I think it's adorable. And this is perfect for summer. I just think it's so cute. It has these buttons down the front and I'm in love. Then from eBay, I bought this uh, leather jacket. I have no idea if I can rock this, but I like to attempt to. I think it'll look mad with dark vampy lips, which I've worn it with, and also killer red lipstick. Like, damn. So, yeah, that's what I had in mind. Then from Maya, I bought this really cute navy crop top with a cluster of these small uh, white flowers on it, and I just think it's lovely for summer and just really cute and quite dainty and fresh. Now onto what I got from Savers. There are three separate trips to Savers in this haul. As you can tell, I love Savers. First of all, yep, I'm wearing a banana suit. This was my Halloween costume for this year. Um, best $25 I've ever spent, not gonna lie. I think it's fantastic. And yes, I look ridiculous. And no, I'm not lying. I legitimately wore this to a party. It happened. Yeah, that's from Brunswick Savers. It's not secondhand, it was part of their Halloween stock. Then, also from Brunswick Savers, I bought this pair of gym shorts. I was trying to go for the sporty chic vibe. Don't know if it's working. They're by the brand Butterfly and they're navy blue. Haven't worn them out yet. Trying to style them. Then, I also got this really pretty baby blue coloured dress. I have worn this all the time. It's my go to dress for if I'm not sure what to wear. It's kind of schoolgirl esque. I think it's really cute. <laughs> Then from Footscray Savers, I bought this other cute summery dress. Again, just great for summer with this sort of lace, I suppose, detailing across the top and the shoulders and then also on the hemline. And it's this really pretty buttercup yellow colour. I also got this denim jacket, oversized as per usual, and I've been wearing this to death as well. I think it looks great. It goes with so many things. Got my favourite badge on it and... I feel hardcore even if even if I don't look it. I and then from Brunswick Savers again I went back recently and I picked up this really nice t-shirt dress with this really cool geometric colorful print on it. I think it's really nice. What else do I say? Then I picked up this dress which is schoolgirl esque again. Again it was from the kids section and it has this cool checkered sort of plaid print on it, high neckline, buttons all down the front. And then I picked up another denim jacket. Uh, this is from the kids section so it's cropped. I think it's quite nice and yes it's Bob the Builder. Basically my wardrobe is a joke. Uh, yeah it's even got his face embellished on the buttons. It's, it's perfect. 
And I picked up this long sleeved black and white striped turtleneck jumper, which I think will look really nice with jeans. I roll it up at the sleeves, even though it's going into summertime, I decided to pick it up. I think it's just a really nice piece. Then I picked up this gorgeous singlet top, which is black and gold lace, and really sort of, I don't know, hmm, neckline, and it crosses over in the back. I think it's really pretty. Great party top. And from Salvo's, my local Salvo's, I picked up this green singlet and it reminds me of Lizzie McGuire. It's got this great sort of scalloped hemming along the straps, along the neckline. I just want to be Lizzie McGuire, so I had to get it. And again, my wardrobe's a joke. I picked up this really cool bag. It's bright pink. It has two seedy looking cats on the front and I just had to have it. Then from Campwell Market, I didn't actually go, my friend did. She picked up this dress, but it didn't fit her, so she gave it to me, and it's plaid, schoolgirly, just really cute, and I love it. Then I actually made some flower crowns, because I'm super original. I made this red and white daisy one, this really quite big one with uh, white flowers, and then I also put some pink flowers in there as well. And then I made this purple, like lavender purple and a darker purple um, integration one. And I think they're really cute. I've worn one out, surprisingly. And then I also glued flowers to this pair of glasses. I think I look ridiculous. Probably never going to wear these out in public. Um, so that's the end of my haul. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, part one will be linked below as, as well as other information in the description box. Check it out. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.